guys welcome back to my channel so today for you guys i have a little rant if you follow me on instagram you'll know about this because it happened like maybe two weeks ago maybe three weeks i think it was like two weeks ago i wanted to do like a whole entire video on this and let me know if you guys agree with me or disagree with me let's just dive on into this video right kind of all tuesday so i have the iphone 8 and i have this phone for maybe like three years now i have a b-mobile sim card i don't ever ever put data on my phone right so it's been three years since i have this phone no i don't put data nothing like that so on carnival tuesday <clears throat> i decided to put data you know just because usually i hotspot from the in phone but not all the time Dean is with me so I was like you know well let me put some data I mean it's kind of all whatever I put the one week unlimited plan mind you I know nothing about whatever packages be mobile offer nothing like that okay so I just went to the options one two three get the information whatever boom so this was like around 4 15 on kind of old Tuesday putting my data putting $130 on my phone the, the plan was $111 it was $99 the $99 plan for the week but with taxes and whatever it came up to $111 somewhere around there um, I put it in and then after I realized well okay I didn't get a confirmation message saying that my plan went through and then all of a sudden like I lose service on my phone I wasn't able to make any calls neither receive any calls so I called B-Mobile and this was like maybe like 4 30 because 4 15 my plan went my plan went in right so 4 15 to 4 30 I called B-Mobile speak to one of their agents they told me that um my sim card needs to be updated because apparently my sim card is a 2g and my plan is a 4g which i don't really understand that terms like my sim card is a 2g and my plan is a 4g so i was asking her so do i need to upgrade my sim card or what do i need to do so to be honest like she didn't quite know like what i had to do so she was like switch off your phone leave it on for 15 seconds it's gonna come back i'm gonna when you put it back on you should be able to get your plan i did that nothing happened so i did that i called like about three times again after that and i spoke to three different agents and three different the three different agents tell me three different things uh, the last agent that i spoke to he was like well okay you need to do so by so go into settings change one or two settings and it started to work so my plan basically started to work like about five o'clock right fast forward my data was fixed and we're good like I was on Netflix, YouTube, everything for the entire week. So I was like, you know what? The week is up. I'm going to put on, let me put on a, like a month plan. So my mom usually put, take this plan for 240 something a month. And she was like, well, take that one. Because I think you get, a, you get texts and you get calls and, and data, right? Now, mind you, we went into B-Mobile. Now, I am not bashing anybody I'm trying to come off like you know harsh or anything like that if you know genuinely a really nice person and i don't like to argue with people and all of that kind of stuff so i went into be mobile my plan was up and on well tuesday right so that was kind of old tuesday that i took the plan so my plan was upping on the next tuesday around four um 15 so i went into my mobile like maybe like quarter to four and i told the guy i need a plan for my phone my mom told him that she'll take the plan for 249 mind you i don't know what what plans they have if you this is what this is my thing and this is why i am so frustrated and so angry even though it happened like two weeks ago if you are working at a network store any store in fact and someone comes in to get something who never purchased that before your advice is to give them their best options right like tell them well we have this and this pro and it's this price but you only get this amount of 
coverage or, or data or whatever the case may be but they didn't do that so my mom she don't really she don't know that about like unlimited data as they were saying which i'll get to she just take like the basic plan so when she, my mom told the guy that you know i wanted a plan for the 240 something plan or whatever and i'm telling them i was like well i have this phone i, I called people by like about four times because when i put in the first plan it then went through and i never put a plan on my phone i don't really know about these plans or whatever so if you are working at this place um your job is to inform me like my best option right i would assume that you, you would but they didn't so the guy continued to like Put on the plan for 249 then after he gave me my phone he was like well um you have unlimited data unlimited calls and texts and something else he was telling me so i said oh okay cool thanks and i was asking him like when my other plan up which i have like for the week it will up like 415 with this plan like will kick in in effect and he was like yeah so okay cool all right fast forward so i leave be mobile like maybe like half maybe like 4 15 i leave be mobile and my mom and i went to south park so my data was on but i wasn't on netflix and i wasn't even on youtube i was just like on whatsapp instagram and um facebook right tuesday when i went home i streamed like about two videos on youtube and that was it i went and sleep the wednesday i had a early day with my mom we went to point so i wasn't even on my phone the entire day i was just like on whatsapp and facebook and instagram right the entire day i was not no youtube no netflix nothing when i reached home in the evening i got a text from B Mobile saying that I used up 75% of my data, right? Mind you, I put on my plan on Tuesday for um, 15 in B Mobile, right? My plan kicked in like about um, maybe like 420 around there. Wednesday night, 10 to 7, I got a message from B Mobile saying that how I used up 75% of my data. How did I use up 75% of my data? Hmm, well, the Tuesday I decided I was like you know what this is this is crap because the guy told me it's unlimited data into be mobile and I told the, the guy was like sitting behind the counter what the hell he was doing but the woman was there and I was telling her I was like listen I put my data on Tuesday I came here and I put it you guys put it on for me Wednesday I was out I only use whatsapp Facebook Instagram and like hardly use it throughout the day because I was busy and then when I reached home in the night and I watched like literally one video Wednesday night I got a message saying that I use up 75% of my data how is this possible if this plan is unlimited as the guy told me and he up and said he was like no I did not tell you the plan was unlimited that package you took is not unlimited so I am like what I was like you told me it's unlimited and he's like no I didn't tell you it's unlimited my thing is if a person is going to spend 240 something dollars on a plan that isn't unlimited you as the people who are selling me you as a sales person who are selling this plan should advise the people like okay listen this is 249 dollars or 240 dollars or how much i ever i pay for the plan um but it's not unlimited you have limited data and you have to use your data wisely you can pay a hundred dollars extra and go with this plan you understand what i'm saying but no you guys sit down there doing god knows what and wouldn't advise people properly so between tuesday to wednesday i've lost 200 and something dollars like, like really and for me to go back in there for you guys to say well it's not unlimited and um facebook and instagram and whatsapp use a lot of data and that's how your data done i mean that is robbery and i'm sorry to say it, but that is plain up robbery i don't care if a person is going to spend that amount of money on a plan best believe you are supposed to advise them and tell them listen instead of spending this amount of money you can put a hundred dollars and take this plan and you have unlimited data so 
they were telling me that you know that um that I use up my data by being on Facebook and Instagram and all this shit which is total crap and I was just like so disgusted I was like oh, okay whatever I really didn't want it to get on crazy because the woman was being really nice the guy was being a nice day and like hi. but anyway so my mom decided to take the unlimited plan which was $393 I'm like I'm like are, are you people serious $393 for that for the unlimited plan and they put it on on her phone he had the woman telling her well this is the unlimited plan but you want to make sure and take off your data so I'm like if this is unlimited data why do she need to take off her data they was like you know because if you leave your data on and running your data would run out and i'm just like so baffled i'm like okay but it's unlimited so why is she paying 393 dollars for unlimited plan if she have to take off her data if her data is going to run out i just like that is just so crazy and a lot of you guys i posted this on instagram and a lot of you guys message me and tell me the same thing that's been happening to you as well and i think that everyone should like if we continue to stay down and like not say anything they would definitely take advantage i mean i don't know i personally will never put data on my phone again unless it 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 is critical and crucial that's the only reason why i'll put data but other than that Hell no. I find it's like ridiculous to the point that if you have people working in a place they're supposed to advise you properly like for a person like me I don't put data I know nothing about data what you tell me about data the last time I had data on my phone was back in 2013 when I had a B mobile and BBM was pumping I don't ever put data on my phone like so there's a lot of people who who's just like me who don't put data we know something about data so educate us a little bit and tell us you know <sighs> i don't know that's just so frustrating that's just like a rant that i had to tell you guys and let you guys know comment down below and let me know if that has ever happened to you with any one of the networks so yeah anyways guys um <laughs> i'm really sorry about this a long rant but this was long overdue i had this boiling in for like three weeks needed to get this off on my chest so i'm really sorry but needed to be said with that note i'm gonna end this video here hope you guys enjoyed this video um well mm, mm, yeah okay <laughs> and i'll catch you guys in my next video bye